Now let's see how we uh, assign variables and uh, how variables and assignments work in HyperDBG. Variables are definitely an uh, essential part of storing registers, value, results of expressions, or anything else in uh, the script engine. Uh, and uh, when it comes to uh, multi-core scenario, uh, everything might be accessed simultaneously in different cores. So that's why we need to have some local variables for each code. The context of the local variables are based on each core. And the thing is, the important thing is that uh, in the current version of the script engine, Hyper, uh, Hyper, Hyper Digit doesn't have any types. So everything is considered as a U in 64 or a 64 uh, bit integer value. Global variables are uh, start with a dot uh, prefix a bit uh, before the name of the value. But if you don't specify any uh, prefix before the name of the value, then it's considered as a local variable. For example, the first example, it just assigns the my local variable to one, which is a local variable. And the second one, as it starts with the dots, uh, it just assigns two to the my global variable. As I mentioned before, local variables are accessible through the cores, but global variables are uh, available through all of the cores. There's some memory sharing techniques used in HyperDBG because uh, it's it's pretty clear that it's a uh, it's some kind of operating system issues that you cannot access a global variable simultaneously between different cores. Uh, we have some interlock or spinlock functions that you can use to access a global variable and share a, a variable between the, these cores. We'll uh, truly discuss about it later. This is uh, an example of L value register assignment. We, we saw some examples from it in the previous slides, but uh, here's a complete explanation. Here's how we can change the value of each registers. Like we, we have, I use an at sign uh, rex uh, which is equal to 0x55 which uh, directly changes the rx value to a static to a static value or if you want uh, to change cr0 uh, variable uh, or cr0 register value to assign it to a cr0 which is uh, or with 0x4 if we want to set the third bit of the cr0 then we use uh, this second uh, command or if we want to change the zero flag or set or unset the zero flag we'll use it like this if we want to just set it to uh, uh, if we want to set the zero flag then we assign it to one or if we want to unset the zero flag then we assign it to zero also it's possible to use a simple uh, expression and assign uh, a register to an expression 